to 72.5. And you can see this, the delineation between flights and just how deep the competitiveness is at the World Championship level. Uh, opening up in the previous flight, we had a 205, very respectable squat, but the contrast here is opening at a 600 pound, 272 kilo squat for the lowest squat in the division. So we're gonna see some big squats, folks. And that was a big squat for Big Mike. We have had a very supportive audience here all week. Teams turning out, world champions turning out to cheer their teammates. Last night we had to bring extra seating out and it was still standing room only. It's a good problem to have, Joe. It's a very fast squat. That's the way you want your openers to look. Get on the board. don't think he meant to go quite that deep or quite that fast. And that was an exciting competition last night. Not only were the 76s, but the always contentious 93s. Wow, that was fast. That was fast. Fully anticipate a large double digit jump. 85, so he's gone up 10. It's a sizable jump, but if I recall correctly, his opener did move well. Yeah, that moved quickly, and he uses a nice big sink. Very light in class at 115.8. And it is incredible to think just how competitive powerlifting has become, considering that these are not A-group lifters, and they're moving bench presses that are absolutely elite level. Oof. Really tried to utilize that, that stretch. As the deadlifts get heavier. Everybody loves deadlifts. How can you not? Especially when they look like that. That was fantastic. Yeah, that was very fast. He's going to attempt 325. A 22 kilo jump. But he had a fast opener, so he'll probably be good for this. Wow, make short work of it. Where do you think Big Mike Leitner from Austria for 337 and a half? And he took just slightly less than I thought. He took 12. Now he's missed his third attempts on squat and bench. Oh, but I think he's but good on deadlift. deadlift. Yeah. And he's happy. Three white lights. Fist bumps his coach, smiles at the crowd. He seems pretty happy with that.